Hey, it's Jason here. I want to show you this to let you know this is what I see. I hope you can read that. Pause it if you have to. Now, this is what I'm studying. This is what I'm learning from. I'm learning to be a calm guy because I'm a radical. Now, with that said, I want to give you another five. Uh, perception. What if we take away religion? What if we take away the good, the bad, everything? What are we left with? We're left with atheist. Okay, atheist. Okay. I myself am not atheist. I believe in God. I myself was raised a Christian. I myself consider myself native. Now with that said, let me give you a little perception of mine. I do not ask for any other entity into my life except for God. How do you know what God is? How do you know anything? Because uh, the devil being God's first angel, and if I myself, I'm a parent, maybe you are too. Our kids are our angels. Turns out, the devil is God's first angel. I would say that'd be God's first son. Why would God's first son be the devil? I don't get it. Why? Does not make sense. I myself have a couple of theories I'll share with you real quick. Um, God and a devil could be the same force. That's a thought. Okay. Also, God and a devil could be separate forces. Maybe it's God and God's son. Opposed. What would make God's first son turn against God? Maybe a love for human beings. Maybe. Uh, maybe he, God's first son or first angel fell in love with humans. Fell in love with with men, women, blood them all. Who knows? I have no idea. I wasn't there. But it's a perception. What's right, what's wrong? I have no idea. What about Jesus? Jesus was not Christian, was not nothing. From what I hear, Jesus believed in love. So you know, I believe in love. I do not ask for the devil or for Jesus into my life. Because I have a mental illness, I'm afraid of deception. And I was told the Ouija board, my mom bought a Ouija board so we could play Ouija. Read me the rules. I was like, holy fuck, really? You cannot ask to open doors to the spiritual realm and leave them open. Maybe this is what's happened many times. I ask no spirit into my life. Why? Because I was told growing up, we are all watched from day one. Our birth, every person's birth, seven plus billion are in the stars. So, what's that mean? I'll make this real quick. Means we are all watched. Means we all have managers who are here to guide us, to teach us what we need to know. Because if this is hell, we are here to make the best possible mark in this world in the name of love. Not in the name of religion, in the name of love. And that's what I'm trying to do. Thank you. Oh, and uh, really, God bless you guys.
because I do believe in God.